When I call to have someone come out, I want to know who it is and know it's someone I can trust. Crop Metcalf is the home of the five-star technician. I love it. When they make an appointment, they keep it. Professional, experienced, and most of all, you can really tell they take pride in what they do. Whatever the problem, big or small, I know I'm getting a Crop Metcalf five-star technician. It makes me feel good. Check out the Crop Metcalf difference. Call 1-800-GO-CROP. Crop Metcalf has actually been the home of the five-star technician since around 2006. I can remember back when uh, my father, Mitchell Crop, Judy Blair, and myself all sat around in a meeting, and we were trying to come up with a new concept in a way that we could rebrand the company, and we came up with the five-star concept. Mr. Crop suggested Tim be the uh, five-star technician. It took a little convincing at first, but I think he eventually came on board with the idea. I hated it. But I didn't realize that it was for the greater good of the company, and it was also strongly suggested that I become the five-star technician. We've done so much advertising with Tim, we thought the campaign needed a fresh take. Plus, I think people just got sick of seeing his face everywhere. Everyone already knows uh, Crop Metcalf's the home of the five-star technician, so we just wanted to build on that. And we thought maybe having an audio component in our radio and TV spots would help link everything better together. First, we thought it was something we could do in-house, so we decided to ask a couple co-workers for some help. 1-800-CROP-METCALF. Call us, and we'll be there fast. Uh... Five-star service! <clears throat> So we thought we'd go to a professional. So when it came to doing the jingle, um, the first thing we did was get together and kind of talk about what we wanted this to do. Um, and then we did a creative brief, which was basically putting together what we call a who, what, what. Who are we? What do people think we are? What do we want them to think? How do we get them to do that? What do we want them to do? And what's the most important message that Crop Metcalf has to, to set? And when we narrowed it all down, we realized that the thing that was most important was the fact that there were five stars. And the five star thing became sort of the hub, the center of our game. So then the point was to try and cre create a line or something that people could hum and remember and so forth. And we went through different lines and narrowed it down through a process of over weeks. And then we put that to music. And the idea was to make it memorable and bounty and upbeat and tempo, so we decided to go with sort of like a serving kind of feel, and we did that and put it together and started with an idea, and one of my partners here, we went to his studio and we started figuring out what the music would sound like after I had played a guitar lick, and then we started drum beats, and, and then kind of figured out what the keyboards were going to do, and we laid down the basic tracks. You know, when we did a really good one, and we think that that this one is one that is going to be uh, on everybody's mind and they're going to be singing for a long time. Great musical identity for Five Night Cow. So we really wanted to kick this off with a bang, so we decided to keep it secret for a little while. I think the only person besides us who knew about it was Rob Greenblatt, and that's because he had to pay our invoices. I'm 100% against the jingle. That feedback aside, we've updated all of our spots and we think that the summer is a great time to launch our new program. Uh, we're very interested in your feedback. Uh, the song, it actually grows on you after you hear it a few times, and we're certainly looking forward to everybody to be singing and dancing in the hallways. Nobody's service is quite like ours. Crop Metcalf is the one with five stars. Nobody's service is quite like ours. Crop Metcalf is the one with five stars. Crop Metcalf is the one with five stars.